Imagine a world where the concept of human does not exist. Dive into the depths of this thought for a moment. Visualize a universe where the very idea of human is absent. A realm where physical bodies with their distinct features and functions are non-existent. Instead, our identity lies in a formless non-physical entity, a soul or consciousness, if you will. In the vast expanse of existence, we find ourselves tethered to our human form. It's this physical body that allows us to interact with the world around us. We touch, we taste, we hear, we see, and we smell. These senses shape our perception of reality, crafting a world that is as tangible as it is temporal. But what if there's more to existence than what meets the eye? What if our perception of reality is merely a reflection of our physical limitations? Consider this, as humans, our understanding of reality is dictated by our sensory input. But what happens when we strip away these physical constraints? How would our perception of the world change if we were not bound by the limits of our human form? Imagine perceiving the world not through the lens of human senses, but through the lens of pure consciousness. A reality unfettered by physicality, where the concept of space and time holds no significance, where communication is not through words or gestures, but through the exchange of thoughts and emotions. What would it be like to exist as a consciousness, unrestricted by the biological needs of a human body? How would our interactions change? How would our understanding of the universe evolve? And perhaps the most intriguing question of all, how would we perceive ourselves? Stripped of our physical form, would we still recognize our own existence? This is the enigma of existence, a puzzle that challenges our understanding of what it truly means to exist. What if our existence was not confined to this physical body, a question that invites us to look beyond our human form and ponder over the boundless possibilities of our consciousness? In the absence of physical form, consciousness becomes the essence of existence. Imagine a world where the human body is not the vessel of life, but rather consciousness is. This is not just a concept found in philosophical texts or the realm of science fiction, but a theory being explored by some of the greatest minds in neuroscience and quantum physics today. Let's delve into this concept of consciousness. It's more than just being awake and aware. It's the deep-rooted sense of self, the internal monologue that narrates our lives. It's the essence of who we are. But what if this consciousness is not tied to our physical form? There are theories suggesting that consciousness might exist independent of the human brain, that it might be a fundamental aspect of the universe, much like space and time. This idea of consciousness existing outside the human brain leads us to the concept of collective consciousness. It's a fascinating proposition to think that our individual consciousness could be part of a larger universal consciousness. A collective mind that shapes our reality and experiences that binds us together in ways unseen and unmeasurable. The implications of such a theory are profound. Could it be that our thoughts, our dreams, our fears are not just ours, but shared across this collective consciousness? Could our actions and experiences ripple across this universal mind, influencing and being influenced by others, even if we never meet? This is the realm of consciousness, a realm where the physical body becomes irrelevant, where the essence of existence transcends human form. It's a realm that challenges our understanding of reality, that pushes the boundaries of our scientific and philosophical inquiries. Could we be more connected than we ever imagined? The answer to this question might not lie in our physical world, but in the depths of our consciousness. The exploration of this realm could reshape our understanding of existence, of what it means to be human, of what it means to be. Could we be more connected than we ever imagined? As non-physical entities, the universe is not outside us, but within us. The human perspective, as we know it, is shaped by our senses. But imagine a realm of existence where we are not bound by these sensory constraints. In such a world, we could perceive the universe not as a vast expanse of stars and galaxies, but as a boundless network of energy and information. Each star, each planet, each nebula, not just a physical entity, but a node of data, a pulsing beacon of energy. If we were not humans, but consciousness, we wouldn't be observers of this cosmic network. We would be an integral part of it. 
Our thoughts, our experiences, our very existence would be woven into the fabric of the universe, not separate but interconnected. Picture a symphony where every instrument is a star, every note is a piece of information, and we, as consciousness, are the conductors. We wouldn't just listen to the music, we would be the music. We would feel the rhythm of pulses, resonate with the melody of cosmic radiation, and harmonize with the chorus of galaxies. This is not an abstract concept. It is a perspective grounded in the science of quantum mechanics, where particles can be in two places at once, and everything is connected through the phenomenon of entanglement. In this quantum realm, there are no boundaries between us and the universe. We are not just a tiny speck in the cosmos. We are the cosmos. We are not just stardust. We are the stars themselves. Consider this. If we were not limited by our human form and senses, we would not just explore the universe, we would embody it. We would not just learn about the cosmos, we would experience it. We would not just dream about the stars, we would be the stars. This is the universe within us. A universe where we are not observers, but participants, not spectators, but creators. It is a universe where we are not just part of the universe, but the universe is a part of us. Opening. What could the future hold for entities not bound by human form or physical limitations? As we venture into the furthest reaches of our imagination, we begin to grasp the unimaginable potential of what a non-human existence could mean. Without the constraints of a physical body, these entities could traverse the cosmos with ease. Interstellar travel, once a distant dream for mankind, could become as simple as a thought for these ethereal beings. The vast expanse of the universe, with its billions of galaxies, could transform from an insurmountable obstacle into a playground of exploration and discovery. Imagine the exchange of ideas, the symphony of consciousness that could occur when these non-human entities communicate. No longer limited by language barriers or the speed of sound, communication could be instantaneous, transcending time and space, forming an interconnected network of consciousness that spans across galaxies. But the future of non-human existence doesn't stop at exploration and communication. Think of the potential to influence the physical universe through thought alone. Without the need for tools or technology, these entities could shape and manipulate their surroundings merely by willing it. The laws of physics, once thought to be immutable, could be bent or even broken, opening up a realm of possibilities that we, as humans, can hardly comprehend. This ethereal existence could redefine our understanding of life and existence. It could challenge our perceptions of reality, pushing the boundaries of what we believe is possible. It's a future that is both thrilling and terrifying, filled with uncertainty and infinite potential. It's a future that invites us to dream, to imagine and to explore the infinite possibilities that lie beyond our human limitations. And as we stand on the precipice of this brave new world, we can't help but wonder, what could this mean for us? What could this mean for the future of existence itself? Closing, the possibilities are as limitless as the universe itself. To imagine a world without humans is to imagine a world where we are not defined by our physical limitations, but by our infinite potential. We've taken a journey together through the enigma of existence delving into the realm of consciousness and exploring the universe within us.